the first one is behind them. This is Kiops and Kefren. Ha Efra. This is for Kefren. This is his name. Ra is part of the names. Ra never dies, so the names will never die as well, like Ra. And this is Kiops Hofu. We can see the third now. Can we get the third? So it's Kiops, Kefren, and Mikeres, father, son, and a grandson. This is the fourth dynasty recalled pyramid's age, 2600 BC. like farms, these are farmer houses, privately owned, unfurnished some of them to delay property taxes. Governorate and Cairo Governorate, where we are now, this is called Giza Governorate. <laughs> well, what do you think? Shall I talk about Islam on the bus? We have the mic and we talk about the five pillars and since we are there, I will explain the mosque from inside and then you have more time to wander around and take pictures. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah, it's better we do it yeah. on the bus and yeah. then you have more time there. Well, the word Islam is the religion people, we call them the people themselves are called Muslims. Okay. Islam came to Egypt 641 AD by one of the believers of Prophet Muhammad called Amr ibn al-As. You know that Islam started in Saudi Arabia and Prophet Muhammad was in Mecca and then he moved to Medina in Saudi Arabia and till he died all of us we used to go, we, we used to be called we are Muslims but after the death of Prophet Muhammad we started to hear about Sunni Muslims and Shia Muslims after his death very few Muslims they said that our Prophet died and the leader after Muhammad should be descended from his royal blood. He had no boys, Prophet Muhammad, so they said that the son-in-law of Muhammad would complete the message. And his name was Ali. But the majority of the Muslims, they said, our Prophet died, and this is what the Holy Quran says, he is the last Prophet. So we will choose a leader in each Islamic province just to set the rules between Muslims there. Those who believed in Ali, to complete the message, we call them Shiite Muslims. And under the word Shiite, we are talking about 500 different sects of Shiite. Even some of them believe that the message was mainly coming for Ali and he was not there. So Prophet Muhammad took it instead. But both Sunni and Shiite, they follow five pillars of Islam. And there is only one book. So we have very few differences between both. The main pillar in Islam that we should make an announcement that there is only one God, which is Allah. Muhammad is the last prophet. Almost all, all Muslims believe in Moses, believe in Jesus Christ and Virgin Mary. We have more than three verses in Quran about Jesus Christ and Virgin Mary. But still, Muslims, they do believe that Prophet Muhammad came after Jesus Christ and he is the last prophet. The second pillar of Islam that Muslims they have to pay two and a half percent of our yearly income as a kind of charity and you have to do before the last day of Ramadan because after Ramadan we celebrate our small feast which stays for three days and we mainly eat biscuits and cookies and we buy new clothes for children so when you give your charities that the homeless people have the chance to eat and drink and wear what Quran says your left hand doesn't know what your hand your right hand gave we do it very secretly 
and you start with members of your family. If your brother needs the money, it's much better to give him than going out to an orphanage or to a hospital.